Do you want to increase the revenue and the profits of your e-commerce store, but you already have your ad set up, your website converts very well, you have your email marketing, SMS marketing set up, and you don't know what to do next? Loyalty and referral programs, that's something you should consider as your next step. As you can see on the graph, winning e-commerce companies, they have their loyalty program set up and also their referral program, and actually that's a very substantial source of their revenue. Big brands like Nivea, they have at least 5% of their annual revenue from loyalty programs. Today I will show you not only how you can set up your own loyalty program and referral program, but how you can connect it with an email marketing tool such as Klaviyo. You can really use a compounding effect because once you connect these different channels and you become more omnichannel, then I really believe that OnePlus one equals three that's what really happens so if you want to learn it today then stick to the end of this video so here's a quick recap why loyalty programs are super important so this is real real data from uh, one of our e-commerce clients so this is a mid seven figure e-commerce store in the clothing uh, industry and as you can see so here are the segment of all buyers all of their historical buyers and uh, here are those who are loyalty program members these are also buyers but even more importantly so these are loyalty program members as you can see there is a huge difference between the numbers so this brand has already more than 35k customers and uh, less than 800 of them they joined the loyalty program but here's the thing so the total customer lifetime value is almost the double uh, when it comes to loyalty program members we compare it to all other buyers and uh, this number comes from Clavio so this is a uh, this is a third party data. This is not from some loyalty app. So this comes from Clavio. So this is the total customer lifetime value and this can be broken down into the historic customer lifetime value. So this is real data. Like these guys, they uh, purchase this amount on the average per uh, person in the past. And this is the prediction what we can expect in the future. Also the number of uh, historic orders, you can see almost there is a twofold difference between the two. Yeah, basically what I just want to show you if you can push these people into your loyalty program then it's high it's very likely that they will spend more they will order uh, more often and even their AOV will be higher that's probably like 10% or even less difference so the main thing is more about how often they purchase and uh, yeah simply just how often they come back and the customer lifetime value so I hope this uh, makes you understand um, why it's so crucial and why you want to push as many buyers into your loyalty program so they will spend twice as much with your store so our go-to tool is stem.io and this is what uh, we've been using for a while there are other tools out there like loyalty lion or yotpo or you know many other loyalty apps why we like stem.io because it has all the great features that we really need and their support is really helpful also I want to give a shout out to STEM, STEM's uh, support and sales team because actually they uh, provided me a uh, free unlimited account so I can showcase the different features of STEM in this YouTube video. So shout out again to the team of STEM and also it's highly affordable. So if I go to pricing, you can see that there are two models of this tool. One is reviews, other is loyalty and uh, we typically go with the combination so if you want to start with the smallest which is the business package then it's 230 per month um, if you go with the monthly then it's a bit more so that's how it works and now I will show you how you can set this up I will use this guide to integrate STEM with Clavio. so yeah basically this is a uh, test account that I set up without test Shopify store and also here's the account that uh, STEM gave me for a few days to showcase its uh, capabilities so let's uh, follow this description so I will click this link uh, go to settings find the public and the private API key so here's the public one and I will create 
create a uh, private key so name your key and i will give full access yeah full access create okay it's been created close and uh, pass this api into standard io install app i need the site id which is uh, um yeah i okay this is the public api the same thing private api i will copy paste this one save it i want to sync custom properties and even our subscribers as well that's useful save and done so how it works how Clavio works because that's what we really like in Clavio. It has a lot of metrics and basically these metrics, uh, many of them, they come from Clavio. Clavio measures the open rate, click rate, all of that. But uh, other metrics, they come from other tools such as MailChimp or uh, custom integrations. Actually here I can pick it. So you can see that uh, these two, they come from stamped. So here's a list of uh, all the data that could come from STEM and as you set up your uh, loyalty program and you know more and more things and there are there is more and more activity subscribers all of that referrals and shares then all of these data will come into Clavio and why this is crucial because you will use these metrics as triggers of your uh, of your email automations or even SMS automations later on so that's why it's crucial you want to make sure that these data they come from stamp properly so it uh, fires the automations in Clavio. okay so after this i want to show you the main flows that you can set up using stamp and Clavio. so the first flow i want to show you is how to introduce your loyalty program to your new buyers or even you, you, your new subscribers if you wish so um and also as you will see so you can use your poor loyalty lion stamp or anything else but actually these are quite interchangeable especially the main flow so i can use the guide of uh, loyalty lion to set up a similar flow actually in clavio yeah these are the main flows you can set up in clavio using loyalty lion but what i want to set up now so i want to introduce my loyalty program to new buyers so i will just create this flow create from scratch loyalty intro flow to new customers let's create the flow and our so the trigger will be somebody placed an order and i will also add this that only once because if they are returning buyers they should already see this thing and we don't want to send it multiple times only once so uh, someone has done and this metric is placed order at least once over all time actually we want equals once over all time save it and done and if you want you can add something uh, else as well like this person has been in this flow only once has not been in this flow at any time this one is it can be something like have you heard have you heard about our loyalty program and voila we can uh, simply install or you know just activate the loyalty program so i want to focus on, on clavio in this video but basically after you set up everything you can install launcher so this means that uh, the loyalty program is active so if i go to the store i should be able to see yes it's here so here's the loyalty program and one of the things how i can earn points is uh, sign up with an account make a purchase or subscribe to newsletter so for example now if i subscribe here i will get i think 100 points can check it. yeah 100 points and i get into clavio we can even check this this is my email yeah it's here actually i already subscribed as you can see two days ago so yeah all of this data is pulled into clavio and this can trigger different automations all right so the next flow will be this uh, thank you flow so basically we will want to say thank you to those people who joined the loyalty or the referral program and uh, actually this will use a stem.io trigger so let's create this flow and create from scratch so loyalty program thank you flow create this flow all right and uh, the metric is earn account new so basically it means somebody joined the program we can also add this filter that somebody has not been in this flow yet so flow filter and send the first email 
which is uh, thank you for joining our loyalty program. And basically in this email, you can tell people how they can benefit from your loyalty program. So you want to show all the perks that they get once they, uh, once they start earning the points and what they can gain, what the rewards are. And ideally you want to add your referral link to this email as well. So they can simply uh, refer you to their friends. So here's an example, a real example. So in this email, we simply tell people that, okay, you earned your uh, first 1000 points and uh, how you can earn more points, uh, how you can get access to them. You can follow this link, how you can use them. And we say thanks again. And here they can check out the rewards on the website. So basically it's a promotion of the loyalty program. And we want to, once they joined, which is already great, but we want, we, we want to incentivize them to use this program even more and collect their points even more all right the next flow i want to show you is uh, a review request or uh, you you can call it ugc request whatever you prefer uh, create this flow and uh, the metric is very simple somebody got a fulfilled order people they can get this flow multiple times that's fine so when somebody fulfilled order not placed an order but actually when the order got fulfilled then uh, we add this email here and uh, some Something like can you help us and here's an example so snap a photo earn reward points we simply tell people that if they give us a review especially photo or, re or video review then uh, they get something they get some points and uh, they can go here and leave a review you can set this up in uh, this part of stem.io it's uh, super simple so reviews and ratings basically you generate a link here and uh, you can use that in your email so they can leave their reviews there the next flow is one of my favorite flows so um, i won't build this out now because it would take some time it's a bit more complex more technical but basically once you set up the reviews in your in your stem account it will push this data into Clavio who submitted the review and then you can set up a conditional split uh, based on the value what uh, somebody gave you as a rating about your product so the trigger is submitted review which comes from stem and uh, here's the conditional split so it equals one uh, equals two equals three then they go here and if uh, it's higher then they go here and i think uh, that's for fours and fives basically and uh, basically we want to treat these two types of people differently so you know where they gave us a low rating um, then uh, we want to say sorry and we want them to be able to reach out to us. Actually, this email could be improved with contact details, in my opinion. And the other is uh, where they are happy. So we try to incentivize them to do even more activities so they can get more points. And uh, we also want them to um, invite them to the referral program. All right, so here's the next flow, which is also a bit more technical, but this is a two month rewards reminder Flow. So basically here's the flow trigger, loyalty and rewards has not purchased in two months and uh, there are also flow filters, placed order zero times since they started this flow and also spend reward redeem zero times since starting this flow. So basically these guys, they are part of the loyalty and reward program, but they haven't purchased for two months. They haven't uh, done anything with their points for two months. So we want to remind them and I want to show you the trigger so the trigger of this flow is actually a segment what this means once they join this segment then uh, they will get this flow automatically and here's the definition so properties about someone stamp the count confirmed is true and if someone is uh, not suppressed so simply if they uh, if their standard account is confirmed and uh, they are not surprised they get into this segment and uh, after we wait 60 days and the software checks again if they placed order or uh, redeemed any of their points and if not they will get this email finally here's the email and simply we just want to remind them that here we have this program you can use your points you can get more points but as you can see as an incentive we give them uh, 1000 points because we want to push them further and we want them to be more active.
Hey Buddha Nation, I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did make sure that you go down and you subscribe to this channel, hit the notification bell so you get updated of my newest videos. Also in the description I will put a free guide of our top 100 highest converting emails ever that you can download for free. And finally before I leave, I will give you one more thumbnail, check out that video, hope I see you soon on this channel.